Hello everybody and welcome to the channel. As usual, my name is of course Constantine and today in the world of indie games, we're gonna be checking out a brand new one called Lucy Dreaming. And this one's gonna be a point and click adventure game. And as you guys know, I love this genre. I absolutely love playing these type of games. And this month has actually been quite a lot about point and clickers because we have been getting a lot of them and even more to come out very, very soon. So stay tuned for that if you guys enjoy this genre, of course. But that being said guys, this game is going to feature some really amazing pixel art styles that I'm going to really, really enjoy. And not only that, but voice acting, which I believe it's really important when it comes to these type of games. As that allows us to kind of connect more with the characters and get to love them, of course. But uh, that being said guys, before we jump into this one, quick moment here, I would like to thank the uh, developer for providing a review copy to share the game with you all. And of course, as usual, if you guys are interested, you can grab the game right now, down below in the description, of course, that's where you're gonna find the link. And without further ado guys, let's just jump right in and uh, start up a brand new adventure. Let's do this. <laughs> Hi, I'm Lucy. And right now, I'm plummeting through the air at 20 miles an hour. OK, actually, right now, I'm in my bedroom, experiencing the same nightmare that's been plaguing me for years. I've tried everything. Soothing lights, meditation, warm milk. I've even tried listening to my dad's now that's what I call calm cassette. <laughs> Both sides. Nothing seems to work. If only I could find a way to control what goes on inside my head when I'm asleep. I might be able to have sweet dreams for once. But until then, here we go again. <laughs> Man, I absolutely hate these dreams where you just dream about falling down. It's just the worst. Absolutely the worst dreams you can have. Alright, look at that. There's oh, Lucy. That was a horrendous way to start the day. Although... <laughs> My dad mentioned something last night that might help with my nightmares. I can't remember exactly what it was, but I made a note of it in my diary. Hmm. Loving the art style, though. It looks like I've just received an email. Ah, there we go. All right. And apparently, this is what we can play with. We can go ahead and pick up a diary right over ah, here. Ah, here's my diary. I must have there we go. And this is the inventory system. Love night. it. Now, where did I hide that key? Mm hmm. So apparently I put a key somewhere, but I'm not sure where. Stuffing. What is that? It's a pretty big piece of stuffing from inside a cuddly toy. Ah, there we go. So that's the stuffing on the floor from a cuddly toy. And as I was actually uh, watching her talk about the dream, I noticed Guybrush Three put here. He doesn't even look like a proper pirate. <laughs> he doesn't even look like a proper He's pirate. He's had enough fun for one genre. Can I talk to him? If I want to exchange insults, I can talk to Lloyd. <laughs> All right, so uh, what am I looking for? I don't even know. It's Let me check locked. the diary. Now, oh, where did I hide the key? I'm okay. sure I left it somewhere well guarded. Well guarded? Well, you know what? The piranha here inside the treasure, I'm pretty sure I bought it. It's my pet piranha, Clive. He's guarding his treasure. Yep, that's where the key is then. It's hmm. got something shiny in it. The key. How do I grab it though? Uh, no up. way, Clive would take my fingers hmm. off. So I'm guessing I gotta somehow get rid of the piranha to get me the key. Wait, is this also Monkey Island? Nice island. I'm not sure it's if Millie I should island. have this on my wall, though. Yes, that's Millie Island for sure. All right, let's check the laptop then. Looks like I've got an email. It what wants the heck my is passcode. I'm sure it's in my brain somewhere, but I can't <laughs> oh, remember man. it. I'll make a note of that when I manage to unlock my diary. Mm. So, of course, we now have to figure out what the password is. I don't is. want to get locked out. Uh -huh. I'll wait until I remember my passcode. Okay, so we also have to remember the passcode. Are you kidding me, game? I better stay in here until I remember what it is I'm going to do. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, what about the mug? A nice grab ceramic it? mug in Adventure Game Blue. <laughs> grab I don't it. want any cold tea. Ah, never mind. Uh, need it's a candle. Got swinging balls. Use nah. it. I'll no. leave it where it is. Hmm. I'll probably end up carrying lots of other stuff around with me anyway. All right, hold up. What do we got here? We got a it bedside feels table. nice when I get in and out of bed. Uh, glass of water. In case I need water while I'm in bed. Ah, uh, maybe I got to use this glass of okay. water uh, to grab me the fish. I can put it on my bedside table if I need any water when I'm in bed. <laughs> I'm All already right. carrying it. Hmm. No, I, I'm trying to use it with the fish, it's but I don't know how to. Pet piranha. Clive. Ah, uh, maybe I gotta go to. Yeah, 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 I know, I know, I know. I, maybe I gotta go to use this with the piranha. 
Oh, I put it in there. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Hmm. I wanted to grab the piranha with it. I don't fancy drinking no. it. That's not what I was trying to. I was trying to grab the piranha, but apparently I cannot really do it with the glass. Uh, can I check the bedside table? It holds all the stuff I might need in the night. All right. Uh, you. With what? Never mind. Uh, pick I don't up. need a whole table. Mm. Okay. Plasma ball. Pick I it up. I can't reach it. Okay. What about He's the? He's too precious to actually play with. Hmm. Stack of papers, pens, and books. Look at the bed. This is where all hell breaks loose. <laughs> uh, we got a poster over here. Let's check it out. I love antiques. Okay. Oh, so this is a spoiler alert. I understand. This button really reveal important hotspots in the section. Ah. How? Ah, there we go. So this is how you see the uh, hotspot. Now, what I'm guessing is that I'm probably gonna need the fish food. It's Clive's favorite. Yep. Apart from fingers. All right, let's grab it. Okay. There we go. Can I maybe combine this with that this? That doesn't need any fish food. No. In that case, use this with a piranha. Good idea. He's always hungry. Here you go, Clyde. Ah, there we go. Pickings. Now he's busy. All right. So while, while he's busy, can I maybe try to grab me the okay. treasure? Let's see what he's guarding. Ooh, yes, the key. key. How awesome. exciting. <laughs> Her accent is actually pretty funny. It's it's really English, of course, but uh, really, it's really funny. It's a small gold key like you find in adventure games. All right, let me use it then the with this. The key fits. Now at least I can read what's inside. Oh, yeah. Finally. My dad was reading some book about positivity. That's a good place to start. He's probably <laughs> left it downstairs somewhere. Aha. Uh -huh. So we got to find that amateur psychology book. And we also have to try to remember the passcode for the laptop. Hmm. Okay. Well, these are the uh, first to-dos that we notes have. I'll in my diary as I go along so I don't forget to do anything important. All right. Uh, what else do we have here, though? Let's check the stereo. It plays cassettes. Okay. Pick I it up. I have a watch that does no. more than this. Uh, can I pick up the stuffing? Okay. Ah, so maybe we can pick up this one as well? Why not? I'll okay. just add it to the rest. Perfect. Uh, what else can we interact with? We got some books, joke books, uh, nursery rhyme books. Can I? Actually, I don't think I need those, no. Oh, hold up. We got a top drawer here. Let's it's check it out. It's a drawer with a little keyhole. I left Dang the key it. next to my fly trap last night, but it's gone now. Next to my fly trap? Ah, next to this guy. He's surprisingly bad at trapping flies, but swallows all sorts of other stuff. Maybe he actually ate my He'd key? He'd my finger off if I tried that. He's always grumpy until he's had a good laugh or two. Ah, until he's got a good laugh or two. So maybe I'm supposed to tell a joke. Right? Uh, joke book. Yeah, let's grab An it. An inspiring collection of jokes for carnivorous plants. Ah, I'll that's what I need. this one on me. Okay, well, what if I just, uh, An look at it. An inspiring collection. No, never mind. I know someone who's going to bust a stem over these. <laughs> Well, let's use this one then with the plant. Why let's get it to open. Why do carnivorous plants like wearing trousers? Because their flies keep getting stuck. He loves these. <laughs> Maybe I should read him another one. Yes, yes, yes. Do it, do it. Because that's going to get him to open up, of course. And uh, give me the key for the drawer there. That. No, what are you, what are you talking about? Grumpy. I use the book Why did the picture plant enjoy being on an all-fly diet? It was so easy to stick to. <laughs> Ooh, There's the key. The key just fell out of him. All right, it awesome. Fell out of my fly trap while he was laughing. Okay. I'm loving the puzzle so far. Not that difficult, of course. It's I'm pretty sure they're gonna get more and more difficult as we keep on going. But let's use the key here with this one. There's Ooh. a roll of duct tape in here. Yes, grab it. Anything else? It's empty. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. What about the middle drawer? It's a drawer that's been jammed shut for as long as I can remember. So we cannot grab that one. What it's about the bottom one? It's not even a real drawer. <laughs> Never mind then. Hmm. Anything else that I should check here? Luxurious carpet. Check it out. It feels nice when I get in and out of bed. <laughs> Alright, anyway, let's get out of here. I have to be careful around the house. If it's old, expensive and breakable, my parents probably have one. <laughs> Man, what's with all the stuff in here? It's like in the teddy bear penny. just ran off. Hmm. 
All right, we got some books, a massive egg, binoculars. Can I grab the binoculars? I, I wonder. I got them for looking at birds and our neighbors. Grab I don't it. need them. Mm. What about the I don't massive want egg? To break it. All right. What about the fishing I trophy? I don't need to impress no. anyone. A bunch of books, a lily. It's plastic. Plastic. Hmm. Okay. What about the bathroom? Okay. Screaming penguin. This what is that? This is the cause of Lloyd's irrational fear of penguins. <laughs> Can I, I grab it? To blow any bubbles. Hmm. A bubble bath and a baby I shampoo. I don't need to wash my hair. Okay. What about this? Perfect for hiding drugs, weapons, and toilet water. <laughs> Open Let's it up. Let's take a look. Ooh, ah. fascinating. A load of vibrant blue water. Oh, you know what? Maybe I'm going to be able to grab some okay. vibrant blue water. No. Hey, uh, hold, up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let's use it again to I grab the water. I don't a glass of blue toilet water. Oh, never mind. Seriously? I actually wanted it's that. It's up. Uh, look. Mm, just a load of vibrant blue water. Hang on. Mm. Where's the bug brush gone? Bug brush. It's up. Interesting. All right. Well, um, what else it's can we me. do here? Cabinet. Let's see what we've got in here. Quite a lot of stuff. A shaving foam, a razor. I've can seen I grab that? Cucumber sharper than this. <laughs> There's no point. It's blunt. Aha. Uh -huh. So it's blunt. Painkillers. Can I grab I that? A gulp. No. Uh, dental floss, face wash, pills. Magic Creamy cream. wizardry for cuts and grazes. If adults oh. are to be believed, taking a bath in this stuff would essentially make you immortal. <laughs> Can I grab I it? I don't have any cuts mm. that need to be magically healed. Maybe not yet. Uh, sweet, sweet medicine. Plasters. Cotton buds. Can I grab some Good plasters? Idea. These are great for patching up stuff. Here we go. We got it. Uh, what about the sweet You never know medicine? when you might need a tasty headache cure. There we go. We got that as well. Uh, shampoo, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need, need it. it. Yeah. And what no. about the cotton buds? No. Hmm. As you guys know, when you're playing adventure games, you gotta grab everything you can find on you because who knows when you're gonna need it. Uh, dental floss, can I grab that? I don't have anything stuck in. No. Pinkulars, razor, and shaving foam. I'm not in the mood. All right, well, I guess that is about it, to be honest. There's a load of hair in the plug hole. Grab I it. I don't want to sink or any plug hole bunnies. <laughs> All right. Uh, what about nah, picking up the towel? Well, mm, I'm no. Damp. Antibacterial I'm soap. I'm not in a cleaning spray, mood. Actually. I don't need it. Uh, I don't need any candles. Don't need that. Okay, I think. Uh, yeah, I think we are completed that here. At least for now. Oh no, hold up. There was something more on the side. Bar soap. Can I grab I it? I don't want to touch it. Why not? Just imagine the things it's seen. <laughs> All right. Let's keep it going then. So we got a lamp. Can it's I turn it on? It's a stained glass Tiffany lamp. Turn it on. Nope. No. Uh, unplug it. It's attached to the The lamp's plugged into it. Fun fact. Mm. In Britain, our sockets have switches on them to turn appliances on and off. You know, in case you were wondering. <laughs> I know. I know you guys have that. I know. We don't How have that here in Romania. I don't know, but there's a little bit more here. And what the heck is happening behind this door, though? That's a better. It's kind of like a peak. green light coming that out of it. That one was suspiciously close to Lloyd's door. I wonder hmm. what he's doing in there. Interesting. Picture of me. It's me carrying Mr. Fumble, my toy bear. This one is a picture of Lloyd apparently, but he's not in the it's picture. It's my twin brother, Lloyd. He was biting the photographer's <laughs> leg when this. <laughs> That's was taken. why. All right, let's go he's inside. He's in there now, but I can't see what he's up to. Mm. Can I look through the keyhole? It couldn't hurt to take a little look inside his room. It looks like my twin brother Whoa. Lloyd is torturing another helpless animal. <laughs> what yeah. the heck? He looks so weird. How is he my twin brother, though? He looks evil. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Mr. Fumble. Oh, my God. What's Mr. Fumble doing in your What's vice? Mr. Fumble doing in your vice? He's going to be so popular with all the lady bears after his operation. He's going heck? to be a magnificent tripod. My brother is an evil genius. Are you kidding me? Give me my Give bear my back. Bear back. Not unless you have something I can add more legs to. Oh, God. 
Uh, why is there stuffing everywhere? Why is there stuffing everywhere? It was clogging up my scalpel. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Improvising. What? What exactly are you improvising? What exactly are you improvising? Groin surgery. What? Dude, this is insane. You. you and me both. <laughs> Empty uh, gerbil cage. Brave little guy's obviously made a dash for freedom. I wonder <laughs> if Lloyd knows what happened to him. I'm guessing he escaped through that window by the looks of it. What happened to your gerbil? He's done a runner. Chewed <laughs> through the bars and escaped last night. That's why I've had to improvise. What the heck, dude? If I turn gerbil, can I have Mr. Fumble if back? If I turn your gerbil, can I have Mr. Fumble back? Sure. I prefer a moving target. <laughs> Hmm. Okay, so we now know we've got to bring him, apparently. I had I enough talking to you. You okay. and me both. What about this... Cute, but kind of creepy. doll, though. Jar of purple oh, liquid. Oh, no. Is that a... Toe? It kind of looks like it. It looks harmless enough. But that worries me in itself. Hmm. Oh, no. Yeah, I'm not sure exactly what else I'm supposed to do here, though. I'm pretty sure that's where the uh, obviously been hamster again. ran off to. Alright, well, that was strange. Very, very strange indeed. My parents nailed it shut after Lloyd threw his hamster out of it. <laughs> Alright, can I go inside my mom and dad's bedroom? I don't even want to think about what goes on in there. Okay, never mind. In that case, I'm gonna make my way downstairs. There we go. Mum's prize salmon. It's... Uh... Photo... A bug brush. Oh! Here it is. I think oh. this is my brother's idea of interior design. Can I grab I'd it? I'd love to. Ah, there we go. That's where the uh, bug brush went to. Um... Willies. It's my mum's boots covered in manky fish scales. <laughs> it's made of hickory and says 11 o'clock. It's also broken and only ever chimes at 1 o'clock. Ah, maybe I gotta get it to chime. Better not. There's no hospital in this game. Hey, there's no hospital I can in this see game. All the way through to the lounge. <laughs> oh, interesting. Can I go inside the lounge? Yes, we can. Ah, so that's where. Wait, what? Ah, I can hear some scratching behind the painting, so that's probably where the hamster, or maybe like up here. It sounds like there's something trapped up there. Yep. Uh, can I use it's the bug had brush? A terrible life. So maybe get it down? Okay. Here goes. There he is. Hey, and of course he's running through the hole. That hole. Dang it. Lloyd's gerbil hmm. sitting right on top of the clock now. Ah, there we go. Can I grab him? It's Lloyd's pet gerbil. He's such a good climber. Pick it up. I can't reach hmm. him. So now we gotta get up there somehow, but of course, the stuff in my inventory is not good enough to get there. So I gotta get myself some stuff to catch him. Let's see, we got a mole. It's a bell jar containing a reassembled mole. My <laughs> mum sure does love dispatching defenseless animals. Alright, uh, coal. Can I grab some coal? I don't need any coal. Okay, fight iron. It's like a tiny sword and shovel. Can I grab them? I don't need them right no. now. Uh, we got magazines, armchair, solo... Oh, this is the book that I needed from Dad. This must be the book my dad was reading. This is interesting. It says you can create a positive dream box. One, find a suitable box. Two, decorate with peaceful runes. Three, add a dream companion. I reckon Mr. Fumble would be perfect. Exactly. Four, Add inspiration to distract from any negative thoughts. Books huh. and other literature work best. Then apparently I just place it next to my bed. This is definitely worth a try. There's a footnote. You can combat fear with laughter. How insightful. <laughs> so I'm guessing my quest now is to create a dream box. I get it because if I go into the diary... Yeah, look at that. Try and remember Pasco for a laptop. Return Lloyd's gerbil. Create a dream box. Add a dream companion to the dream box. And add inspiration to dream box, which is laughter. Wow. We're going to have so many to-dos here. Uh, can I grab some of that suit? No, thanks. No. Hmm. If grab I with the my bedside. empty box. An uh, empty glass. No. Okay, never mind. Uh, photo album. Can I grab oh, that? Oh, precious memories. 
Ah, oh, there I we go. I can use the bottom corner of each page to flip through the album. It looks so good. Look at that. Look at all these people in Oliver the photos. Oliver Cobblestone. He sees dead people. Oh, God. There just had to be a rubber chicken somewhere. <laughs> of course, it had to be a rubber chicken somewhere. He helped to kickstart this whole thing. Awesome. I'm, I'm, hope, I'm wondering if uh, these people that are in the photos here, maybe they're Kickstarter supporters? Our local gauntlet salesman. And of course, maybe the devs as well. Woof. Wait, this puppy is in my room. So where is the puppy? Woof. Hmm. Look behind <laughs> a you. Three -headed a three-headed monkey. Three-headed <laughs> monkey. Oh my god, I love this. These guys make video games. Takes all sorts, I suppose. I don't think that squash they're drinking. <laughs> this is so what cool. A lovely trip down memory lane. Right, can I grab me some fruits? I'm not hungry for wax. No. Hmm. Uh, play the piano. I don't fancy. It needs tuning. It needs tuning. Uh, use. Ah, uh, there we go. But of course, the thing is, we gotta tune it. I don't know how to read music. I don't need to carry a load of sheet music around. All right. Um. Hmm. I think that's a kind of about it, to be honest. It's my mother hunting a mole with a blunderbuss. Can I pull the uh, ceiling two fan? Speeds. Slow, Slow and mental. And mental. <laughs> Uh, use. Aha, uh -huh. so this one is a slow one. Let's go mental. Uh, I'm guessing that's mental, right? It's got two speeds. Okay. I don't know if I can do anything with it, to be honest. So, let me go out here for a second. Now, when I look at the clock... It's hickory and says 11 o'clock. It's also broken and only ever chimes at 1 o'clock. Okay, so but maybe I gotta set this one. on top of it. Maybe if I set this one to 1 o'clock, it's going to scare the mouse and he's going to run away. But the question is, how do I set it to 1 o'clock? Use. Ah, all right, set it to time. 1. Now it says 1 o'clock. There we go. And the mouse ran off, of course. He's gone back through the hole again. I'll hmm. need to find a way to stop him going back in. Stop from going it's back in. Industrial. Can I maybe use the duct tape to block this? Ah, stop there we go. That getting in or out. All right, and now let's try to get it's the mouse. It's a terrible life. I'll use this with this. Okay, here goes. Oh, the thing is, it's coming back in. Maybe I need to take the tape off the other side. Yeah, but if I take the tape off, oh, where's it gonna go actually if I do that? Hmm. Let's pick that okay. up. Okay. Let me change. Uh, first of all, it's let me scare him off on this side. Okay. Let's see. So he's gonna run to that hey, side, right? It ran okay. Into... Now we gotta use the tape to block this side it up. It might be better to block it up from the other side. Uh, from the ah, never mind. So what if I just block it off now? Like that. That should stop anything getting in or out. And now we set this one to one. Now it says. Let's one see what's gonna go. There we go. And he's not gonna be able to go in there now, which means I'm gonna be able to pick him up. No, 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 he's right. gonna run eye in the shoes. Now he's there we in go. My mom's welly. I'm sick of <laughs> carrying this duct tape around too. Oh no, seriously, you... duct tape is good. Uh, pick up the shoes then. Finally got the little fella. There we go. I'll get rid of this bug brush now. It's minging. <laughs> All right, so we don't need the bug brush anymore. But what I'm gonna need is to get rid of the mouse it's by simply boot. giving it to uh my brother. Throwing a gerbil at his door won't achieve anything. Oh, never mind. Use with I Lloyd. I have your gerbil right here. Yeah, right. You're not coming in. No, nope, I have it. to get it back into your room if you won't even open the door. Use your imagination, sis. Seriously, dude. Um. Use. I'm not squeezing a gerbil through there. You've come out the other side like hairy toothpaste. <laughs> So how am I going to give it to him then? I don't get it. Am I supposed to go out and throw it through the window? Hmm. Strange light. I dread to think what's causing that. Alright, um... Uh, use with that. He wouldn't fit under there. Um... 
use with keyhole. I'm not squeezing a gerbil. Th hmm. Skull knob. I can't criticize. I have a skull lamp. Uh, use. I don't want to go in there. Hmm. Then how the am I supposed to give this guy his gerbil if he doesn't want to open the door? He's in there now, but I can't see what he's up to. It's use. locked. There must be a better way to see what he's doing in there. Dang it, dude. Seriously? So, am I supposed to go outside? I'm not going out there in my pajamas. Oh. Hmm. Am I supposed to change? It's not raining. Okay. Um, squirrel kitchen. It Let's leads go to, the kitchen. to the kitchen. Uh, go in the kitchen. I think it's still out of action after last week's incident. <laughs> what? It's from my parents. We're what? out at the regional otter flinging championships. D -d Don't huh? let Lloyd start throwing stuff out of his window again. And please, d -d don't go in the kitchen. Your mother accidentally took out the stopcock with her crossbow. And there's water all over the floor. Oh, God. D -d -d Dad. <laughs> all right. Uh, what is that? It looks pretty startled. Huh. I Get don't up. need it. Okay. Large rack. Can I open up this rack? Oh, it's locked, I think. Yeah. It's a small lock for the top cabinet. Cream of the Bream Award. Use it. I don't have the key. Yeah, of course. You gotta open that up I somehow. I can see the badger's head in reverse. It's oh, the badger's head in like reverse. It's hanging by a thread. Interesting. Can I grab the eye of the He's not in great the, uh, condition. Badger? His left eye is literally hanging by a thread. Uh, grab the loose eye. The bit of thread just snapped There we off. go. Awesome. Uh, Melee's Melee's. European Oh, badger. we also have a thread from it. Scraped off M54. Interesting. So we got a thread, an eye, plaster, gold pole, whatever this Berry is. flavored analgesic gloop for children. This sweet hmm. medicine's the only bright side to having a cold. There must be a whole lot. And it smells familiar. Can I open up the cupboard? No idea what's even kept in there. Use. I don't have a key. I don't have a key, of course, to open that up. All right, well, at least we got ourselves an eye, a badger eye, and a thread. What I'm going to do with them, I have absolutely no clue, to be honest. Uh, a valuable boss. and precariously balanced family heirloom, apparently. <laughs> Let me help you place it there, though. Go to the stairs. All right, um, what else have we got here? What about this? The garage. Huh. A backpack. Can I grab it? It's my rucksack with my shoes and underwear in it. I don't know how she's calling it a rucksack. Got it. It's got a badge on it from an Easter egg hunt. But I'm hoping to oh. collect a few more badges. Let's check out my badges. Ah, there we go. There's I one badge. this badge for hunting Easter eggs. I wonder if I'm going to add more badges to my backpack by simply unlocking achievements in the game. It's hopefully that's going to be a thing. It's got spaces to add new badges. Yeah, it's hopefully we're going to do that. But we have no badge at the moment. Now... What are they washing in here? My clothes are spinning around in there. Huh. Washing machine. Can I use if it? If I want to turn it off, I can use the socket. Oh. It's for collecting the washing lint. Uh, okay. Open it up. There's a lovely plump lint bunny in here. <laughs> All right, so we got some it's lint. It's a pile of lint from the washing machine. Interesting. White powder. I'm hoping that's washing powder. Can I grab it? I don't want it? it all over no. my hands. Uh, what if I use this to grab An it? An empty glass wouldn't help no. there. Hmm, lawnmower. It cuts and it sucks. Use I'll it. I'll do my chores another day. Okay, okay, never mind. Uh, what about the gardening stuff? Use. I'll go digging for treasure another day. No. What about the ladder? A good, tall, sturdy ladder. Use. I don't need to climb anywhere. Pick it's it up. It's not the portable kind. Hmm. All right, we got some maggots. Can I grab those? I don't need to go fishing. No. What about the nails? I don't need any nails. Uh, maybe the red stuff? I don't need any D. I don't need to. What about the bottle I here? I don't want to. Yeah, yeah, dude. Uh, I think I'm also going to need the box. And I think the weed killer box is probably the I'm one I'm not I making need. explosives today. It's no a smallish cardboard box. This looks like a good size for my dream box. Okay. I'm guessing this one it's was too big. big for a dream box. Yep, yep. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, rusty nails. Not without a tetanus shot. What about the paper? No, it's knackered. Oh, <laughs> uh, the accent though. Jar of white no, spirit. No, it smells horrible. Mm. I don't need any paint. 
I don't need any paint. Okay, so we don't need any paint. What about the pliers then? Got them. Aha! Uh -huh. What about the nets? No point. It's got okay. a massive hole in it from the last time I tried to stuff it into my rucksack. <laughs> and lastly, we got... I don't um, need a length of rope. Rope? No. Well, I guess that is about it, to be honest. We have quite a lot of things in here. Pliers, um, lint, rucksack. So what do I have to put inside the box? Let's see. Hold up. Let me go up here. Um, actually, I gotta check One, this. Find a suitable box. Decorate with Two, peaceful runes. Decorate with peaceful runes. Three. Add a dream companion. I reckon. So how do we make a peaceful runes in here? What about if I use this with the but box? It doesn't need stuffing. No. What about this that with the box? That doesn't need a glass eye. What about uh, this it with the box? It doesn't need tying no. up. Hmm. What about using the plaster with that the box? That doesn't need a plaster. No. Uh, can I get some washing powder? Removes bodily fluids, industrial lubricants, and grog. <laughs> There's already some in the machine. Oh, uh, in that case, use... Get the socket out. There we go. And now... Stop going round. Open it up. Okay. Ah, there we go. A wet washing. I need to dry them out before I can wear them. Ah, uh, so maybe that's what I gotta use in order to make it out. I get it. Uh, it's empty wash machine. now. I don't need to do any more washing. Okay. Can I... Remove now... bodily fluid. Can I now grab I some of this? No. How do I get this to wa Oh, you know what? I think I know how to wash it. Yeah. It's doing a good job of locking this door. It's doing a good job of locking this... I don't need to open this... Okay, okay. In that case, let me go through here. Let me make my way all the way uh, upstairs. Because I have a feeling if I'm not mistaken, I am supposed to use this to dry it out. It feels so. nice when I get in and out. Let's use this for this. Using a fan is a great idea. Unfortunately, this one doesn't have the required torque. Ah. This one doesn't have the required torque. It feels nice when I... Hmm. So how do I dry my clothing then? It's a skull lamp I picked up in a junk shop. It doesn't work. I just like the look of it. <laughs> Alright, never mind. Um, hmm. The thing is, I still don't know the password for the laptop. It's got swinging more. Yes. Okay. Clyde oh, there we go. used to love it, but he's not that bothered these days. Book, uh, nursery rhyme book. More books here. Stack of comics. My collection of manga comics. It's a, a big round map of the planet. It's a money box. No matter hmm. how much I put in, it never gets full. <laughs> it's it empty up. right now. Ah, okay, never mind. I'm still one. trying to figure out, uh, not this one actually, I'm still trying to figure out um, the passcode for the laptop, and I really don't know how to do it though. How do I remember that? I wonder. Light switch. It turns the main. Use. I don't need to adjust the lights. Hmm. I was just trying to uh, Bro, turn it off. Maybe there was some needs. secret codes around here somewhere, though. Let me check Hickory this book. Dickory Dickory Dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one. The mouse ran down. Hickory Dickory Dock. Rodents have a really hard time in some of these. <laughs> Look at this. This actually tells you a little bit of a uh, secret on how to actually get that rodent down the clock. And that we already done, of course. I love antiques. Hmm. I'm not seeing any numbers around here that I may need to use, though. That's what I'm trying to figure out. If I have any numbers that I gotta use that are probably gonna be the uh, passcode for the laptop. And I have no idea how to remember that passcode, though. Caring for your piranha. So... I know I can grab some water from this. It's my pet piranha, Clive. Say hello. Say hello, Clive. That's a boy. <laughs> Atta boy. All right, I don't think I'm going to be able to it's grab that. It's great for sitting on. Can I use it? Maybe later. All right, let's get out of here then. 
So, hmm, we have quite a lot of things. Can I maybe use the pliers? The thread this? doesn't need straightening. Oh. So where am I supposed to use the pliers on then? I wonder. This is the bathroom. Uh, can I maybe use this in here? This towel's wet. Probably because the towel rail doesn't actually work. Looks like uh, I might have to spin dry them somehow. We gotta spin dry them somehow. I get it. So I cannot dry it up here. But where am I gonna have to spin dry it then, I wonder? Hey, Lloyd, what are you doing in there? Oh, that's none of your business. Charming. <laughs> There must Charming. be a better way to find out what he's doing in there. Yeah, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. I want to try to figure out how to spin dry these things. Hmm. I mean, it can leads I go to the, the kitchen? kitchen. Yeah, go in. I think it's still out of action after last week. Never mind. Um, go outside. I'm not going out. Nope, not in the pajamas. How do I spin dry these things? So I wonder. Ah, now I get it. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, stop this. There we go. Let me get the clothing on yeah, top of that. Yeah, this seems like a really good idea. <laughs> there we go. Activate. But it needs to go faster, so activate again. <laughs> oh my god, we throw water that's everywhere. Probably enough. Awesome, we dried them up. Hey, that actually worked. There we go. They're all dry. Yes, and now we can use them. Some privacy, please. <laughs> to get out. Look at that. We got it. We changed. Awesome. Can I grab the magazines? Oh, there's a free camouflage lip balm on the front. Mm, oh, whatever that like is. Peaches. Peaches. Camouflage lip balm. Uh, can I use it to decorate there we this? Go. Some nice yes, relaxing it did. runes. I'll put awesome. it next to my bed when I'm ready. All right, so we got the runes in there. Next up. Um, if I check in here... Talking to books is a... Uh, create a dream box. So, let me go here, actually. One, find a suitable so, it is box. decorated. Add a Two, dream companion and add inspiration to distract. Okay, okay, okay. So, now that at least we have this... Oh, I see the backpack uh, in my back. Look at that. Awesome. Alright, let's go outside. There we go. Hmm. Harpoons. My mum was harpooning moles this morning. <laughs> what My the heck? mum was harpooning. Uh, what is that? It's the chalk outline of Lloyd's hamster. Ah, it's chalk, the chalk outline, outline of the Lloyd's, of Lloyd's hamster. hamster. What is that supposed to mean? So how do I throw the hamster up there? I'm not strong enough to wang it all the way up there. Well, I guess I gotta harpoon it then, right? Let me use the threads in here. It doesn't need tying up. Oh, I was trying to kind of make like a slingshot out of it. Uh, I'm not by these Lloyd. two? No. Oh, the heck was that? Use this with the that harpoon then. help me get him back to Lloyd. Hmm. How then? The drape by is all broken by looks of it. when mum was harpooning. Any rain ah. coming down there is going to go straight into Lloyd's room. So this means the harpoon shot something straight inside the room there, right? But how do I get this thing to be shot in there then? Use. I don't need to kill any moles today. No, I need you to harpoon this inside room. Uh, that won't help me get him Lloyd's back room. to Lloyd. Why not? Isn't that how it's supposed to work? My mum was harpooning moles this morning. All right. What about this rain pipe? It leads all the way round to Lloyd's bedroom window. Huh. Can I use I'm it? I'm not a great climber. Uh, can I put the mouse in there? I hate to do this, but I need to get my bear back. Ah, there we go. So he's probably going to go back inside the room there. Yeah. <laughs> back we got for it. More, are you? Well, I won't be <laughs> back needing for more, this yeah? anymore. Awesome. There we go. We got him. We got our Mr. Fumble. Come to mummy. <laughs> Man, it took so long to actually get this uh, thing with us. And we haven't really started the uh, nightmare yet. I 
can see into the lounge. Oh. It's used. locked. Okay, never mind. Uh, what about the bike? It's got a puncture. Looks like I'm Dang not it. going anywhere until it's fixed. Hmm. I can't use it in this state. Its front tire needs fixing. Yeah. Oh, can I maybe use the plaster to fix it, I wonder? This should patch that hole in the tire. Great. Huh. It's still flat, though. I think it's flat, which means I gotta pump up some, um, hmm, some wind in the tire. Also, at the same time, I think if I'm not mistaken, I gotta use this stuffing with it just the bear. Needs one more bit of stuffing. I don't see any more lying oh. around. Hold I up. guess I'll have to find something else to stuff him with. Yeah, we got the stuff from the uh, washing machine, so let's use That's this one. That's a nice plump bear. Now, I just need to get him sewn up. Uh, what about using this? I'll need a needle if I'm going to mm. sew him up. Yeah, I definitely don't have a needle, though. Use this They're with this? surgical pliers. No. Yeah, so where am I going to find the needle, though, I wonder? What about the, uh... It's bin? full of household rubbish. It's I... full of household rubbish. I am not rooted... Can I look it's for it? It's not bin day today. No. Hmm. It keeps the public out. And my brother <laughs> in. Keeps the public out and my brother in. Love it. All right, well, we still have to find some sort of a needle somewhere in order to fix up the uh, bear. But I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything outside at the moment. Actually, hold up. Is there a way to visit other places, like neighbors? Nah, I don't think so, yeah. What about the bush? Bushy. Bushy. I don't need to use a bush. Okay, let's go back inside. So, where am I going to find the needle then? I wonder. This was Lloyd's first victim. It had to be sewn back together again. His teeth Aww. are like little razors. Oh, his teeth are like little razors. So am I going to be able to use that as a needle? I suppose his sharp teeth might come in handy for something. Yes, exactly. All right, so can I combine this with He's this? He's already reassembled pretty well. No, uh, use them with His this. teeth might damage it. Hmm. He's got remarkably sharp teeth. Can I maybe use the pliers to grab the teeth? I'm not teeth? a rodent dentist. No. Ow, his teeth are still really sharp. How do I grab him from him? His teeth might damage it. Hmm. His teeth might damage it. Use it with... um. What could I use it to grab those teeth, I wonder? He's already reassembled pretty well. Hmm. Use this I'll this. need a needle if I'm going to sew him up. I know that. Ow, his teeth are still really sharp. He's got remarkably sharp teeth. Yeah, so apparently his teeth are really sharp, but the problem is, not quite sure how to grab the teeth, the sharp teeth, out of them, though. That's kind of one thing that I'm struggling to figure out right now. It's a nice wooden table. It's empty. Uh, oh, this guy has a hook. The fish has a hook on him. It's stuck in its mouth. Uh, now use the pliers to get the hook. Come here, you little... Got it. <laughs> there we go. Alright, now, combine these it's together. It's not straight enough to use for sewing. Oh, uh, in that case, I'm going to use the pliers. There. Now straight it's a it straight fish hook. Awesome. And now, combine this these together. Handy. There we go. And now, use this to there fix the bear. Go. All stitched up. There we go. Finally fixed up. All right. And now if I go into my diary, add a dream companion to the dream box and add inspiration to the dream box, which is laughter, right? So let me go back in my room. I think I'm also going to have to dress up again uh, using these. Some privacy, please. <laughs> All right. Hopefully we're going to be able to now it sleep. Uh, so let me put this on the table. It might work better somewhere else. Wait, what? What do you mean, somewhere else? Uh, here? Great stuff. There now it's ready to put things into. Let's put this guy there in. There we go, Mr. Fumble. There we go. And the joke book. Well, I suppose this counts as inspiration. All right, and now, if I check this, we got it. Try and remember the password for the laptop, though. That's the only... Oh, we also have to fix the bike. Seriously? So we're not done. Hmm... Now, what could the password be, though, I wonder? I'm still confused about the password. This is where all hell breaks loose. Use. Okay, I'm all ready. Let's do this. Oh, 
Never mind. Apparently, we're going in the dream world. Well, this is what? different. It's not exactly what I'd call a sweet dream, but I suppose <laughs> it's a step in the right direction. I wonder if there's anything wow. here that can help me with my nightmare. I seriously doubt Whoa, it. the bear is talking. Are you kidding me? I have a feeling we're going to be able to traverse through the dream world to the real world as well. And through all these worlds, we're going to be able to collect different resources that we're going to be able to use in between worlds. Uh, such as, for example, made the password for the laptop. That was probably going to be in the note here. Not sure, but you know what, guys? This is really, really special, and I'm currently really, really loving the game. I had no idea we we're going to be able to traverse from the dream world to the real world like this, and uh, back and forth, back and forth. This is actually going to be very, very special. But anyway, guys, that being said, thank you all very much for watching this first episode of Lucy's Dreaming. And when we come back the next one, we're going to keep on going here, try to see what else we can do in the dream world, and uh, try to keep on going with the adventure. All right. Anyway, guys, that being said, stay safe. Don't forget that the game is available right now. You can go ahead and check it out using the link down below in the description. And with that being said, stay safe, everybody, and I'll see you soon. Bye.